This is Hegaru Education Center. Say, I have a guest today. Here's a hello to Peter. Hello, Peter. And I say hello to our friends. Hello, friends. Here's on your stomach. It's apparently won awards for boosting children's right brains. And now you can do it normally. All right, here you go. Hegaru packs in over 40 activities within 60 minutes. And this is how it's done. By talking so fast, the teachers managed to cram in three items in under a minute. Trapezium. Trapezium. Excellent. Try is a trapezium. Try. 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 Try was thrown at me at enormous speeds. Is that okay for babies? Do they actually pick anything up? So unlike the left that is slower, the right side of the brain has this ability that's able to process information very fast. It has photographic memory function as well as uh, music and creativity. Right. So if you do an activity at normal speed, the baby is just using the left side of the brain. If you do it so fast, the left side cannot manage. So that's how the baby will actually turn on the rest of the brain to cope with the speed. According to proponents of right brain training, the two sides of the brain process information very differently. Our left brain is in charge of logic, reasoning, and language. It processes information slowly. Our right brain, on the other hand, handles creativity, memory, and processes information quickly. Hegaru claims that right brain training from a tender age will build photographic memory, analytical thinking, and better concentration. So, if we don't stimulate the right hemisphere of the brain, what happens? After three years old, the development of the right brain will start to drop. For example, those abilities like photographic memory, the ability to process information very fast, creativity, even music. All these abilities will start to fade or diminish after three years old. If still left untrained, the right side of the brain will just become dormant. So there's this uh, very short window from birth to three years old, they need to maximize to fully stimulate the right side of the brain. After three years old, we have a different program that focus more on the left side of the brain as well, like logical thinking, like uh, analytical thinking as well. I'm sure you get skeptics. What would you say to them? Adults like us tend to be more skeptical because we always have this mental barrier. And what do I mean by this? In fact, children who are three years old and below, they don't have mental barrier. Don't have the concept of what is difficult, more difficult, most difficult. So from birth to three years old, that's the best time when we just input all sorts of information, regardless of difficulty, to the children. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Oh, you see, uh, 
Despite their skeptics, since starting in 2013, enrollment has increased over tenfold. And now they run over 100 classes for children three years and below every week. Have you seen improvements with your older children after coming to Higuru? Yes, definitely. Like, yeah, um, especially my uh, oldest boy. So he's in the preschool uh, program now. I can see that his photographic memory is there. Example, like, you know, when we read a book, so he can remember like the pictures, like the details, like what color dress is the girl wearing, what color book is the uh, girl holding on. What are your goals in bringing her here? Well, to open her right brain, you know, okay. so that she can become more smarter, you know. She's been coming for a few months. Has she got a photographic memory yet? Yes. She has? Yes. Why do you want to make her smarter? I think every children, every parents want their children to be smarter, right? So when she go to preschool, she's always ahead of someone, okay. or a lot of the children. I hope that he has a better memory and that will help in his uh, academic in future. Yeah, that's the more important thing. Can a child's learning at six months old impact his later development? Well, I'm still not sure. So I'm going to put myself to a test by pitting myself against a five-year-old. Hello. How are you doing? So I hear that you are my competitor. What's your name? No, I'm Peter. Nice to meet you. How long have you been coming to Hegaru? From a baby to now. Do you think you can beat me? Yes. Wow. Of course I'm going to win because I'm much older and more intelligent. So I've got Teacher Paige here. One of the things that Hegaru will help you to do is to develop a photographic memory. Could you explain what I'm about to do? We're going to have an activity called Link Memory. I will say a story twice for you to remember and say out all the keywords in order. So I, I have to repeat back all the keywords in order. H yes. How many cards were there? 30. Well, I mean, that should be easy, right? Because I, you know, memorize words every day. Let's do it. Are you ready? Yes. A llama drove a crane truck to pick up a triangular pyramid and put it on top of a castle that belonged to a strong sumo wrestler. <laughs> of a small hummingbird that flew through a gigantic yuri. One more time. A llama, a strong sumo wrestler, washing seat, and a jump into the sea. Yoga, turtle, university, a telephone. Let's see how all the cards in order. Oh gosh, first one. I think I had it a second ago. Uh, gosh, ready number one. It's an animal. Oh, 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 oh. Triangular pyramid, drives the crane, the triangular pyramid on top of the, the castle. Come on, what's the first one? Um, a llama. What's the next card? Crane truck, triangular pyramid, castle, a small wrestler, 81, dive, flight, washing machine. And in the washing machine there's a seahorse that is wearing a raincoat and he's hot, so he jumps into uh, the ocean, the sea, sea? Yeah. Uh, and then, oh gosh, oh, and there's purple coloured turtle. There's one more card before purple. It's a food item. Chocolate starfish, I don't know. Yogurt, softball, duster, parachute, university, telephone, Squirrel. Squirrel had got ice cream at the Ferris wheel. No. The squirrel, the squirrel called with the telephone his uh, ostrich friend. There's oh. another cut before ice cream. Ah. No, I don't want to give up. So how long have you got left of the episode? Because you're going to be stuck here watching me do this for... Toothbrush. Coming but Earring. <laughs> wow. That was fast. OK. So I lost to Donald, a five-year-old, who remembered all 30 words in order. So this right brain training really does seem to be working.